Ella and I'm the Plants Meow and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a different kind of unboxing because today's unboxing is actually sponsored. I know, so weird. So <laughs> the reason it's sponsored is because all these plants were actually sent to me for free. I'm not paid to say anything, so I'm going to give you my honest opinion on these plants. I was just sent these to do that and I'm going to do exactly that. I do want to let you know, um, Right now, weather-wise, today they were delivered at around 48 degrees, so it's kind of low, it's not the lowest, and additionally, they weren't shipped with any heat packs. They actually don't provide them, so I want you to be aware of that before you go ahead and place an order. You may wanna wait till springtime, unless you're willing to take that risk. <laughs> so the company itself is called greenspaces.id, and that is their website name. So on their website, you'll notice that it mainly specializes in philodendron and anthuriums. So today, I believe all my plants are anthuriums, except for one, and <laughs> so I'm excited to just kinda like showcase them to you guys. Also also, if you want to follow them on Instagram, it's philodendron.indonesia, and there they post updates of their plant photos where you can go ahead and look at them. So as I unbox these plants, I will go ahead and find the listing on the website for you and place it just right over here whenever it's necessary. So that way you can know what it's identified as because sometimes with import plants, they don't call the plants by the same names that we would. I'll also post a little video here of Samba who actually sent me this clip of him just kind of showing what plants he was sending me. And I thought that was really sweet. I don't know if they do this for everyone or just me because I'm doing this video for them, but I thought that was really adorable. Uh, so thank you so much for doing that. It was super cute. Okay, so I'm just going to detour for a moment here and kind of just go over their website for you, just so you can kind of get an idea of what to expect if you do go on it. Okay, so the first thing you'll notice on the website is it does say free shipping worldwide. Now, what does that mean? So when you actually click on that, you'll see there's actually a list of zones and the prices that your order has to be at minimum in order to basically be eligible for free shipping. And honestly, this isn't bad, especially because shipping with FIDA certification can be $85 and upwards. So I think this is a crazy good deal. And I'm actually surprised that they do this. All right, so back to the main page. If you scroll down, you'll notice they have two categories. They have philodendron and anthuriums. Then if you go down, you'll see some promo discounted plants at some cheaper prices their bestseller plants, and their most popular plants. So also at the bottom, there's a little messenger button. So if you wanted to just message them on Facebook with Messenger or the little WhatsApp button so that you can go into WhatsApp and just start talking to them through there. So back to this home page, I'm going to go into the philodendron category. So you'll notice they have a bunch of philodendrons here. All of them very reasonably priced. Like this Ring of Fire is only $15, which is pretty crazy. But there's a lot of good things to choose from. And if you go to their menu and click Shop, you can go to All Plants. And that'll show you not just philodendron and anthuriums, but you'll have your aglonemas, your alocasias. Honestly, I didn't even realize they had at the time until now so that was pretty cool wow look at this watsoniana that's pretty neat got some ethereums in here so they've got a ton of great stuff and a ton of awesome priced options so here's my favorite category which you all know and that is anthurium they have a lot of good stuff here. Like this Doriaki here for $45. That's just so good because I've bought in my Doriaki for over $100, probably even around upwards prices of $130, $150 here in the US. So honestly, if you get a bunch of these plants and then you qualify for free shipping, honestly, this is so worth it. Just a really great alternative if you don't want to spend a lot of money. Also, here's some crazy cool pictures of him with a giant Magnificum, some crazy big Melanochrysums, and even a variegated Melanochrysum. Like, how cool is that? So I hope you enjoyed that little 
bit of an informational website video. And now I'll go ahead and start the unboxing. Oh, and I do want to show you really quickly. Here is my box. I always love how compact these import plants are. <laughs> Okay, so this first plant here appears to be my Anthurium magnificum, and I can tell by its square petioles. So this looks to be in excellent shape. There's actually three leaves here, and I'll attach a little link to the website on the side over here, just to show you what you would look for if you wanted to get this plant. It appears to be wrapped in a damp paper towel. I'm not sure if there's sphagnum here or not, but either way, it seems pretty good. And I will look at the roots before the end of this video and just kind of show you what they look like. For our next plant, we have this Philodendron melanocrysum. Super cute. It looks like we lost one leaf, but that's honestly to be expected. They are more sensitive shippers. Now, honestly, with imports, this does happen, but it looks absolutely beautiful. Just look how cute that guy is. <laughs> so, this next one appears to what they refer to as silver blush. Just a really darling little plant. Super sweet. <laughs> Very adorable. I absolutely just love the roundness of these leaves. Very, very cute. I'm really happy with all the inferiums right now. Everything looks to be really healthy, especially because you kind of expect a lot more to happen when it comes imported from another country. So it is really nice. And especially with the weather and how it's been, 48 is not the lowest by any means, but we were, but it's kind of nice to know that it can still arrive in this condition with it being fairly chilly outside. To be fair, they did use DHL Express, which is awesome shipping service, and it gets here super quickly. So I think they shipped it out on Monday and it's Wednesday now. Really, really excited about this. I don't have one of these. Finally, I have an Anthurium VGI. I don't know why it's taking me this long to get one because <laughs> it's been definitely one I wanted. So I'm really excited to have this plant in my collection right now. And it's just super cute. I just can't wait for this one just to get really big. I think I may end up actually putting it in my bathroom one day. I think it would look super cute there. Just hanging up above. <laughs> really can't wait. Just so, so stinking cute. Gosh. <laughs> All right. Whoa. Look at this beautiful, stunning specimen. So on their website, they actually refer to this as an Anthurium Siri. And I think that is basically a Radicans or a Radicans Dressleri hybrid. And it's so nice. Gosh. Wow. I just absolutely love these red petioles here. Well, really, they're just like this deep burgundy color. It's 
absolutely gorgeous. And these pebble leaves, oh gosh. Like I can't get over the pebble leaves. I have a plant like this one, but I think this one received probably maybe a little less sun because it's a lot darker than mine. And it's so nice. And I'm a little bit obsessed right now and I can already see new growth in there. Wow, I'm really, really just overall impressed with this plant. Just, wow. <laughs> like, just look how nice. That looks just so healthy. I can't wait to show you the roots. I hope they're fantastic as well. Super, wow. Super, super impressed. <laughs> Okay, so this particular plant on their website, they actually refer to it as the Ace of Spades. So I know it's not the Ace of Spades that we typically think of. So I know what you're thinking, this is not an Ace of Spades, and you are correct. The reason I thought it was an Ace of Spades is not because I thought it looked like one, it's because of this website photo <laughs> that did confuse me. I do wanna let you know that this is not the plant in the picture, it just happened to really look like it. So I'm not quite sure what that means exactly, whether it received more light or it's just possibly a different plant, but it's really beautiful. It's so big too. I'm impressed with the size of a lot of these plants. Just look at that. These have all arrived so nicely. I'm really surprised because sometimes even just within the US, you'll get plants that arrive pretty crappily and it's just like, Okay, so these can travel internationally, but somehow they can't make it a couple of states away. Just very interesting. <laughs> wow. I think the veining on this is red. This is really cute. So I actually can't think of what this one's called at the moment, as I'm unfamiliar with it. So I will put down below what the website calls it and insert here a clip from the website. So if you do like it, that is what it's called. It's interesting because it actually has this red edging along the leaf and kind of like a, a pebbly velvetness to it. It's really cute. Let's see if I can get that red. It's really adorable. <laughs> I'm trying to think what it could be. Can't put my finger on it. It actually looks like a hybrid to me. Cause I'm unfam I'm very unfamiliar with this plant. <laughs> Okay, so upon seeing this next plant, this plant right here is what they're selling as their Anthurium Doriaki, which I was gonna say it looks very similar to a Doriaki because it is so round. But the veining appeared a bit different than mine, so I just didn't assume it right away. So this one I believe is their silver blush, but it also looks like Agnificum crystallinum hybrid. It's really pretty. The silver on this one is absolutely stunning. Just gorgeous. Wow. So crazy enough, none of the anthuriums have lost any leaves. They all came perfectly, which is <laughs> crazy. So I'm pretty excited about that. Very impressed, very, very impressed. Definitely just look at what titles I linked below if you want that particular plant because it may be, some, be called something different. So you may be looking to purchase a plant that's called one thing, but they have it listed as something else. So just look at the titles I've listed if you wanna go ahead and buy that plant. So I've been really happy with this purchase. Everything came in 
perfectly fine. I will be inserting a clip of their roots probably around here. So hopefully the roots are good. If not, you'll be able to see. I'm gonna be washing and cleaning all of these pretty much right after this video because I wanna make sure I'm not bringing anything into my home. So I'll definitely be showcasing this right now. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a like down below. If you want to see more content, please subscribe and hit that bell icon. I do put out a video every Wednesday and please let me know down below your opinions and let me know about my new microphone because I just bought one. So hopefully it's good. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching.